so good. Hi, I wanted to get all dressed up and look cute, but it's just not what is going to happen right now. But no, I did not just slobber. I am just going to explain what I wanted to yesterday, but couldn't. So I just got back home this morning. I have to work in like two hours and I'm borrowing my boyfriend's mom's car for the week or two until I can get a car loan and go look for a car, which is really great. I feel very lucky and thankful that she has trusted me to borrow one of her cars and it's a huge responsibility. I got hit by a car on <laughs> Valentine's Day. So last Monday, February 14th at 8 a.m. on my way to work. Well, I hit the car but it was the car's fault that pulled out in front of me and we collided and my car is totaled as you will see on these photos my car is totaled the airbag came out and it was insane um to say the least i am still going through the trauma i am so scared to drive to where i like drive so far away from the car in front of me um and when i see cars break it gives me anxiety so there's that i have ptsd from it um i've never been in a bad car accident and this is my first i'm very scared <laughs> i never want to get in a car accident ever again to say the least so i'm waiting on all that drama to be done but yeah so basically we have one car and i have that's why I haven't been able to go upload any videos the last week because I have just been traumatized. I've been going through a lot. I'm just getting anxiety talking about it. My chest hurts really bad just thinking about it. When I was reading the credit report yesterday, I had so much anxiety. Like my head started hurting and my chest hurts from where the seatbelt saved me, where it stopped me from going through the windshield and the air from the airbag as well the impact on the airbag and my seatbelt really like hurt my chest so bad i'm fine now but like when i think about it or have anxiety my chest starts to hurt which is insane so that just means my body has not fully healed from it yet um so i'm just trying to play it safe and be careful my whole desk is a mess um <laughs> but it is what it is i was i just don't have the motivation to dress up and look pretty for you guys um and this is just me being honest like it's been really hard so i have a trip going up coming up in a few weeks literally like 22 days 19 days i'm going to florida and i'm super scared because we are riding a huge like tour bus all the way down there so yeah i'm super scared but that's what's been going on with me. I hope to finally get some videos filmed and pre-filmed for that time, but I am hoping to film sometime this weekend so that I can have a video up for you guys. I'm behind on like my project pan. I'm behind on other videos that I had planned, but I just, I've been trying to relax and calm down from the event. So I hope you guys bear with me. This is just a short update explaining it, so. What I can tell you is the cars are the cars that I'm looking for and you already know like <clears throat> I'm back home from work and the lighting is so bad okay that is a lot better but yeah so my hair is a hot mess because I just got back from work and I've been wearing a hat all day but that's okay um so where was I oh yeah we were looking at cars and I still did not finish this so I'm gonna finish this energy drink and get some videos filmed today so where were we I think we were talking about cars okay I'm really excited but also very nervous because I am taking out my first ever loan yep you heard that I was very lucky to not have to take out any loans for college um which was amazing. Taking out a car loan freaks me out. I have so much anxiety. I'm really scared. I have this feeling that I'm not gonna get, that I'm not going to get accepted, even though they just called me a few days ago saying they did accept me. So right now I'm just sorry. My hair is a mess. So I'm probably. I'm sorry that I keep messing with my hair. It's just not cooperating. I took a shower earlier, and it's. This is what it looks like normally. It's like weird. It's not straight. 
But anyway, I am just waiting on the credit union to call me back so we can get things finalized because I live three hours away from this certain credit union. I have to get everything situated on, on the phone before I can go ahead and go look for the car. I have two different cars that I'm looking at and I'm just going to share them with you guys. I don't know exactly what I'm going to get, but... These are just what I'm looking at and I thought I would let you guys know because it's so exciting and I will vlog whenever I go look at them. So, I am going to get a Jeep. I want to stay in the Jeep family. My whole family, my friends know this, they've known this for years that I want my own Jeep and that's what I'm going to do. So, I'm really interested in the Jeep Compass, the new body, which looks like this. Um... The specific colors that I would love to have are black or white, but there is a gray one that I've seen online that I really want to go look at, so I might be going looking at that. So that would be like my third choice for, for a color. And then I'm also looking at a Jeep Cherokee. One of my best friends, she has a Jeep Cherokee and I've fallen in love with it ever since she got it and now I want one. So, but my main requirement for my car, because I am taking out my first ever loan and it's a car loan and it's going to be an expensive car for me, my... <laughs> My one requirement is that it has a remote start. Um, I've never had a car that has a remote start, so this is really exciting. I live in Michigan, up north Michigan, and we get a bunch of snow. Too much. It's so cold. So I need a remote start because I am just tired of waking up at 5.30 in the morning to go start my car. Now I know that sounds very like first world problems, but I've struggled with that and that's just one requirement that I want, that I have for my next official adult car, I guess. Um, my next requirement is that it has to be a 4x4. Basically it goes into four wheel drive because of where I live. And we live on a dirt road and there are hills everywhere by us. So I need to be able to drive through the snow in the winter time. Um, so those are just the two main requirements that I want, need for my next car. So I just thought that was exciting to share with you guys. But yeah, other than that, I'm super excited. I am just waiting to get everything finalized and I'm excited. I'm just excited that it's finally happening. Good things are coming out of the bad things and... I'm ready for the next chapter so this was just a little update I hope you guys enjoyed let me know how your Valentine's Day went because I'm pretty sure it was better than mine yeah so other than that I've just been in a trance just trying to relax and recover from this injury I actually have a headache today just from driving three hours all right guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, I'm sorry this video is so chaotic. I just things have just been Very messy in my life right now, and I have no control and It's insane. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to update you guys and let you know what's going on I hope next week will be a little better. If not this my videos I'm gonna try to have some videos posted every three days like I usually do, but yeah. Um, leave me any questions, comments, concerns down in the comment sections down, down below. I always reply to them and I just love hearing from you guys. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. <laughs>